explosive situation in Marion County. The discovery of live bombs at a former World War II plant. The Army Corps of Engineers is working to detonate the devices at the site along Pole Lane Road that's just northeast of Marion. 10 TV's Jessica Goddard was there as the blasts went off. It looks like video you'd expect to see of a war-torn country in the throes of conflict. But this is actually the view from Jim and Kathy Marshall's doorstep, a mostly residential road surrounded by farmland near the Marion County seat. Almost sounded like a sonic boom, and about 30 seconds later heard another one. And uh, you can hear all the glass in the house shaking, all the windows. These are planned detonations. The Army Corps of Engineers discovered two live bomblets here last October while cleaning the former bomb and ammunition making facility. This is where the Scioto Ordnance Plant stood. Established four months after the U.S. entered World War II, it produced M74 cluster bombs for Allied forces, some of which are still being found on this site 68 years later. The Corps is destroying the munition debris over the next six to eight weeks, in part to prevent property damage. Neighbors were sent this letter telling them to expect explosion noise, dust, and some vibrations. I definitely want to let my kids over there. Engineers say the bombs being detonated would not explode on their own, but do have explosive potential. Jim Marshall says knowing that, hearing the explosions brings him a strange sense of relief. You don't never know when somebody might get over there and a kid might play and one would go off. So, you know, thankfully they are getting them out of there. It's just a shock when it happens. A situation diffused after decades of a potential disaster undetected until now. In Marion County, Jessica Goddard, 10 TV News. Access to the area is restricted to the public, as you might expect. The Army Corps of Engineers estimates work will be finished by June 30th.